Alzheimer's disease, it's a devastating diagnosis that no one ever wants to hear. And its effects go beyond the patient. It impacts family, too. It probably took me, I guess, close to two years just to get out of being upset all day, every day. Now, it doesn't just stop at the mental toll. There's also the cost of care to consider. One man in Merriam had to come out of retirement just to help cover the care for his wife. KSHP 41 News reporter Caroline Hogan heard from him about the struggles and his hope for what's ahead. Yeah, that's great. John Ross and his wife, Lisa, joke that they're attached at the hip. She ran the company. She ran the business. I was just the technical person. I did all the camera work. But John had to take on more work at their photography studio when Lisa was diagnosed with Alzheimer's in 2020. As this developed, we had to close. I couldn't do everything, and it was a huge emotional adjustment for me. It's also a big financial adjustment. When you need to get a caregiver, mm -hmm. you're looking at somewhere in the vicinity of $600 a week. That's why he has to pick the camera back up and come out of retirement. Lisa can't be left alone under doctor's orders, but their studio is conveniently attached to their home. There's a number of things that I need to cover mm -hmm. and take care of our bills and keep her here. We've been in this house for 30 years now, mm -hmm. so I want her to stay here. Alzheimer's is, is a huge health crisis, but it's also becoming very much a financial crisis as well. Through her work with the Alzheimer's Association, Michelle Girard has seen just how many caregivers struggle, like John. Has this always been a big issue? I think it's been a big issue, but for sure with the pandemic and the staffing crisis that we have um, encountered, you know, the prices are just going up and up and up for long term care. And of course, the emotional toll I'm is busy. just it's as okay, taxing. Sweetheart. We're going to be OK. All right. The one thing to take away is that when it's your spouse, you don't get to go home. You don't get to go someplace and rest. You're not out of it ever. A photo holds a thousand memories, and John's hoping to be able to make more with Lisa at his side. We have years left, and I want to make sure she's 100% taken care of here. In Kansas City, Caroline Hogan, KSHB 41 News.